Home Sweet Home in the radio studio for the very special Amsterdam Dance Event broadcast. Right before the 14 hour live show. So here we go. Start of 836 minutes of live radio. Everybody's ready. Matt Fax is ready. Ruben's ready. Yo. Let's get the show on the road. And we kicked off with the lovely progressive sounds of Matt Fax makes a noise. And two weeks ago, you released your debut album on uh, Contrast on Enhanced Music. Uh, tell us something about it. Yeah, actually I was saying that uh, this album is a project that I wanted to make since a long time because uh, it took four years to make. Actually, yeah. I always restarted from zero because I wasn't sure of myself, but I'm finally really uh, uh, proud of putting this out. It's really amazing. Joven, you're here by yourself, but uh, I recall it, Tunisia used yeah. to be a duo, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it used to be, um, but um, you know, we had decided to go separate ways for the benefit of ourselves because uh, we, we both have, uh, I think, uh, we, we looked at the future differently. I mean, Cyprian wanted to do other stuff in music yeah. and uh, I think this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. So I couldn't quit, I just had to continue with it. One of the most consistent, uplifting producers of the last couple of years. And yesterday you played a back-to-back -back set with Amir Hussain at Entrance We Trust. Uh, how did it go? Yeah, it went very, very well. It was uh, like a rave cave, very <laughs> intimate crowd. Cool. And everybody's <laughs> going <laughs> mental. It's hey, and there's big news because you launched your own uh, radio show, High Voltage. That's correct, yeah. I'm uh, launching a new radio uh, show, High Voltage. And is that every month or every week? Uh, it's every month. Man, how um, how did it go? I mean, uh, you were here as in Amsterdam. Mm -hmm. Do you experience an event like this? You mean, do you, are you start handing out demos, or do you hanging out at the event, or did you do you go to special parties, or what do you do? Uh, actually, I've been invited to play here. Uh -huh. <laughs> but are you going to any other parties or hanging out, seeing friends? Yeah, seeing uh, some uh, colleagues, uh, going to ASAP uh, at your uh, event. You're yeah. coming tonight. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> You've been uh, making a thing, reworking classics and making them your own. Uh, previously you did Children and this week you released your rework of Bartes on the move. Yeah. So do you prefer old school melodies or do you love doing reworks? I love to do uh, something new with the old stuff. So uh, I love to work on the melodies as well. You uh -huh. know, because the melodies from uh, back in the days were so good. Yeah. So I want to bring them back to the to the new uh, world of trance. I actually can't believe he's here. He's playing the 14 hour radio show as Exclusive set, Mr. Paul Oakenfold. Well, first of all, thank you so much for coming down. Thank you for the mini set. You've made uh, music for a big amount of movies over the last uh, couple of years, right? Matrix, Dying on the Day. Yep. And uh, actually. are you working on something else in the near future again, like um, movies? I, I'm work currently working on something. Um, I don't know if you know, but I went to Mount Everest and played at base camp. So we made a documentary. Nice. About that, that experience. And I'm uh -huh. writing the music to it currently at the moment. Okay, so share a message with your friends in Indonesia. Terima kasih for tuning in to the state of trends and <laughs> thank you so much for the support. Thank you. Uh, thanks a lot for coming here. Big fans of your work. It's really great that you came thanks all the so way from Indonesia to here, be here. <laughs> How did you guys team up? How did that happen? Tinder. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I had a cute smile. Yeah, <laughs> of course. <laughs> it's been over half a year since the release of Unity. Is it about time for another track, guys? Come on. It more than is, to be honest. Yeah, we're well aware of that, we're, and we've been busy in the studio the last few months. So, so you actually work together, or you just send projects? No, always together. We we like uh, collaboration, motivation, a physical presence. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, can I have some noise for Will Atkinson? Uh, what are you working on at the moment? More stuff like uh, this track, leave a message? Yeah, so uh, a lot of stuff, like this sort of vibe, just humor is the new, the new nails, I think, so I just sort of bring a bit of fun back into it, like you said. But it's all becoming minimal, like that old Picado sound, you know, BXR. Strapping it back, yeah, strapping it back, big sounds, just big ideas, but just keep it simple, and I think that's that's the future. Like, yeah, it's very, it very effective, man. Absolutely awesome. love it. And um, Happy days. You played this in Trans We Trust as well last night. Share something that happened yeah. backstage there that normally shouldn't go out in the open. Some saucy stories, what? come on. <laughs> Involving me. <laughs> And since it's Amsterdam Dance Event, we have a lot of great uh, DJs visiting and saying hi, just like this man, my good friend Julian Jordan. Yo, Yo how's your Amsterdam Dance Event so far? Uh, really good, actually. Really busy and uh, a lot of great meetings, press and uh, parties. So you're one of the rising stars. Uh, is it? What do you think about the current state of uh, you know, your sound? Is that really flying? Because some people say EDM is over, and some people say it's growing. What is your take on it? I don't know, like the maybe the sound is changing, but I feel like electronic music is like really big right now because like every pop track on the radio is like electronic. Like That's true, almost yeah. everything is produced electronic, and I think a lot of producers are on their most creative uh, story right now. They the most creative part of their life because they can finally do everything they want. I feel. It's 5 p.m., which means that we go on with the radio show in a different way. Don't forget that at 10 p.m. we'll switch to the AFAS Live in Amsterdam for a live broadcast. With big names like Protoculture, Cosmic Gate, Ali and Fila, Stand the Wick, back to back with Ben Gold. And still coming up, John Askew. He's in the building and he'll play a set for you in just a bit. Welcome a man that opened the show in the club today, Ilke Klein. What's up? Yes, I'm good. How are you? Yeah, so happy you are here. Um, big fans of your sound, and we can only find one man to kick off the State of Trance in the Armada Club. So, Well, th uh, thank you. I'm honored. And um, your label, Days Like Nights, surely going strong now. Yeah, yeah it's going uh, it's going really well at the moment. And your new track has a Dutch title, Geloof uh, ik. The, the Order van de Nacht. Yeah. The yeah. Order van de Nacht. Okay, good luck with that. The Order van de Nacht. The episode just announced Poland as one of the very first uh, cities we'll visit with the State of Trance being the moment tour and right now one of the rising talents in trance Davy Asprey how do you follow up a tune like that Davy oh here we go again the mic uh, ah. Yeah, it's been uh, a bit of a struggle, but I've been working on some things, so hopefully... Well, you played some excellent remixes as well, thank so... You. Thank and I you. love that Kayo and Alba remix you just finished. Yeah, well, thank you guys for inviting me down earlier this year and introducing me to them, which sort of got the ball rolling, and... Uh, nice. Yeah, it's, been, it's been absolutely fantastic. First of all, Blaster Jacks. What's up, guys? Yo, yeah, we're good. A little tired from last night still. So, you know, tiny eyes, but uh, everything is going well. Yeah, how was, uh, how was your party? Was it really crazy? Oh, it was really, really crazy. It was insane. Like, it felt like a festival. Like, everybody was jumping. Like, from the very first uh, DJ set until the last one, it was really in intense. What was the biggest track in your set? Is there a particular one? Uh, uh, biggest track? Uh, basically, everything from ourselves uh, went really well. Yeah. yeah? Cool. Very cool. Because who's also behind the microphone, ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Oliver Heldens! Yo, hey, what's up? Mm -hmm. Hey, you did a party last night in Paradiso here in True. Amsterdam. How yeah. was it? 
Yeah, <laughs> crazy. <laughs> Too crazy, maybe. But um, you know, the thing was, we, we didn't want to have less screens anymore. No. So we, we built a, a boxer ring. A boxing ring. Boxing ring, exactly. <laughs> and uh, I, I came up, we also had a catwalk. So I came up as a, a boxing champ. And also the other DJs, they would they have their own suits and they would come up as a boxing champion. And remember my track, Zokolo? I'm so happy and honored that they're here in the studio right now. It's my good friends Gabriel and Dresden playing brand new music. What else can we expect on the on the album? Uh, well, we brought back Jan Burton from the Dangerous Power era, Gabriel nice. and Dresden. Nice! So he's and singing it, a bunch of tracks on there. <laughs> and uh, there's a big surprise. Josh Gabriel pulled in a really good vocal performance. Josh Gabriel, right. you're singing yourself. On one song, yes. Nice! <laughs> That was amazing. So Thank you. amazing. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Thank was that you. the first time you did that live on the on, on the like, on the like this on the radio? Oh, yeah, so. we wouldn't do it on any other radio station. Ah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> this so, was better than when he was on his own, though, wasn't yeah. it? <laughs> Hey, no comment. It was also a bit more messy than the other one, right? No, it was awesome. I mean, the fans <laughs> were going crazy. Did you guys love it or what? <laughs> Artem, uh, how's the Alpha 9 uh, journey been so far? It was incredible. Yeah? The best decision I ever made in my life. Are you only doing Alpha 9 gigs now? or uh, Both. Both. And uh, uh, do you feel like a different person when you're performing as Alpha 9? You, you have different outfits when you play as uh, yes. Alpha 9. Yes. That's the whole reason about it, but uh, I think it's pretty incredible to have both projects going on because it gives me so much freedom and space to work in a sets. Like when you work in Alpha 9, it's completely different music. There's no clashes in the records. I don't play the same records in both sets, and it's just so amazing and refreshing for both projects. And right now, we switch to another location in Amsterdam. The state of Trance, live from Amsterdam. Back in the studio in Amsterdam to record episode 838 of A State of Trance. Don't forget to tune in. Lots and lots of new music, including the new Paul Oakenfold and very special guests to premiere their brand new tracks. Look who it is. First date. We got Service for Dreamers and Ben Gold in the house. So tune in to episode 838 of A State of Trance on YouTube, on Facebook, or check it out on Spotify. And I'll see you next week for a new vlog.